Hey guys, what's going on? It's Salvatore, here, and today we're going to be talking about Spider-Man 2 and Venom, and basically, who Venom might be eliminating from this game. Now, personally, I think that Venom is going to be going on a rampage in this game. I think that there's going to be story beats where Venom is just completely out of control. There's going to be very scary moments where Venom is just going to be completely wrecking carnage throughout New York. Now, go ahead and tell me in the comments below, who do you think Venom is going to be taking out? Who a main character or potentially side character he's going to be taking out in this game? I would love to know your guys' thoughts. And go ahead and like the video as well. Let's go ahead and get to 200 likes. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. You guys have been killing it. So let's go ahead and get into it the first thing that we want to kind of get into is how this would push miles or peter kind of past the edge now we know that miles and peter right now they're not like happy go lucky i want to say they're really really like happy at all like miles lost his dad and of course peter lost aunt may and they're really in a dark spot if you look at where they're at right now i mean Miles basically lost his friend and Finn, and all he has right now is his mom and Genki. So he doesn't really have a lot to hang on to. And I would say that basically Miles is the one to really push the most. Peter really doesn't have a lot to lose besides, I would say, a MJ and like potentially a, a few other friends he makes along the way. But realistically, Peter really doesn't have a lot of loved ones or family members that he has to lose anymore. So Peter is already kind of past the edge, and I think the symbiote is going to kind of push him to that edge, and I think it's going to be very interesting to see. Miles, on the other hand, still hasn't been pushed to that edge specifically, with at least his Spider-Man powers, at least emotionally as Spider-Man. So I think it will be very interesting to see how, of course, Venom will affect that in this next game. Now, lore-wise, if we look into the comics, spoiler alert, I don't think a lot of people really care about the comics right now. The Ultimate Comics are something that are very long ago as well. So if you haven't heard about this, sorry. But Miles' mother basically dies in the comics by getting shot by police while they were trying to take out Venom. Now, it's not Venom who kills her necessarily, but it is basically Venom's fault. <laughs> if you just held still, just wait a little bit, and let him get like collected or something, then, then none of that would have happened. You know, Miles' mom would have survived. Nothing bad would have happened to her. Now, I think that you know it's so weird to say but like marvel spider-man and marvel spider-man 2 seem to be taking a lot from ultimate spider-man i believe it is and and also just the cartoon that is the the least liked one where harry becomes venom and stuff like that and i i think that miles and having his mother die is something that is very very interesting to have for his character going forward because it would push him to really be like spider-man full on like what else will they really have besides being spider-man and i i would really like to see how that would be pushed and twisted in this game and i think that insomniac would kind of go that far in doing that so i would love to see how they would do that the next one would be to basically kill off mary jane as well if they don't kill off rio if they don't kill off miles morales's mom then i think that killing off mj would be a really nice twist as well now of course realistically a lot of people think that MJ needs to stay in this game. And even like from what I've seen, a lot of people don't really like this rendition of MJ, even though I think that she's one of the best ones. Uh, she actually does something in this fucking rendition of, of, of course, the Spider Man universe. But uh, MJ dying and taking a place of Gwen, and then Gwen coming in and taking a place of MJ would be a very interesting twist within the universe. Now, Stanley has actually said that he actually in intended for Gwen Stacy or wanted Gwen Stacy if he kind of kept to it. Uh, to marry Spider-Man, or at least Peter Parker, and have that be his happy ending. So maybe that, in some way, is what Insomniac is doing. They're setting up MJ to be Peter's first love, his most important love, and then dying to the hands of either Venom or even Green Goblin in this game or the next game, and then having Gwen come in and kind of take her place and have Peter have a happy ending while Miles continues to be Spider-Man. That could be something that they can e easily do. A very dark twist that they can also do is have Peter do it. If Peter goes around on a rampage and accidentally kills, rather, MJ, or accidentally kills fucking Miles' mom, that would be incredibly dark. That would be so insane. I don't know if they would really go that far. If they're really going to be having Venom possess people and really go that deep. I think that Venom is going to be someone that, or something that you can control. The symbiote, of course, is something that you can control and that you kind of let take your emotions and kind of amplify it. You kind of like 
it's it's more of an addiction thing. Of course, they're they're going to be playing with the addiction part as well. So I think that Peter's going to be trying to get that off of him as much as possible. I don't think he's going to really push the line. I don't, I'm sorry, not push the line. I don't think he's going to cross the line. I think he will push the line, of course, with Craven and whatnot. But I don't think he's going to actually go over the line and start killing people. And uh, even if he is taken over completely and possessed by Venom, I don't think he's actually going to go out and kill like you know MJ or Miles' bomb. Even if that would be an incredible twist, I would love to see more horror elements in this game like just seeing you know mj be more terrified seeing something like of course the first appearance of venom where he's hiding inside of their apartment and then mj comes back and she's just literally traumatized i would love to see something like that adapted or of course having miles's mother get murdered and seeing miles's reactions to that like seeing more just traumatizing and horror elements to these characters i would like to see that especially with venom in this game you know they they i think this game is actually already confirmed to be t for teen so you know it's not gonna go rated m for mature so i don't think we're gonna get anything too mature too crazy but it is very possible that we're gonna get crazy bloody images <laughs> unfortunately and i think that that's gonna have something to do with of course the crazy deaths that venom has uh going to afflict in, in this game when it comes out so tell me what you guys see in the comments below i would love to hear you guys thoughts about what's going to happen in this game or what's going to happen in the story this is basically just a theory i'm going to make a ton of these in the near future until the game comes out which is going to be october 20th so go ahead and subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see you guys on my next one peace out